In this video I'm going to show you how to install Link from Office 365 site and add a contact. We will use Link to assist you with configuring your Office 365 trial. Log into the portal. Go to the download section. Find the install link step, step number two, and inst install the 32-bit version. Or if you have a 64-bit computer, choose the 64-bit version. Choose the run option. Uh, um, respond to the user access control click the install button use Microsoft update when I check for updates this will keep link up to date this installation will check if you're have some of the prerequisites and if they aren't um, installed on your computer such as Silverlight they will be installed in this process. Now that Link is installed, start Link Note the box is ticked, I'm just going to click close and Link will, in, will launch. Sign into Link. Now your address is going to look a little different because you've just begun the trial. It's going to be the domain name you chose, um, then dot on Microsoft.com and sign in. Initially when you sign in it will look for a another component to download which is called the Microsoft Online Sign-In Assistant or Sign-In Services. When this prompt comes up download and install now. Again, click Run. Accept the license. Install. The prompt down here about the Link Browser Helper add-on, you can respond to that. That's something that is added into Internet Explorer to help highlight things such as phone numbers. So you have to respond to the user access control and elevate to administration and administrative installation. I'll bring that back to the focus. This application installing now will help to log you in to all the Microsoft online services. Click finish. Now we can go back to link and we can sign in again. This time it's going to prompt us for a username and password. Well here's our username already. And we can now enter our password. It's okay to save your password when you change your password later it will prompt you for the new password and we're in you'll be presented with uh, a little animation and um, screen that will take you through some of the basics of Link. I'm going to close that for the purpose of this video and just show you the important part of getting in touch with us to help you with your trial to add a contact, begin to type the 
address within this search box. Press the enter key. Even though it says presence unknown in the initial search box, when you open up the instant messaging window, it'll go away and query what my online status is and find me. So now we can ask Daryl for some help. Daryl's going to respond. So there you have it, have a go, and um, hopefully we'll be in touch soon. Note that the contact addresses that you may want to search are um, on our contact page. Hear from you soon.